Hitting the button. Damsel here, my sister, and you and welcome back to Starbound, and I am joined by Tim. Hello. So, the Tim's just. Are you doing base stuff, or are you also? Yeah, I'm just doing base stuff. Okay. Which probably won't take me too long. I'm just doing this. Uh... I want to have a look at kind this. of elevator shaft here. Yeah. Just want to have a look at that planet quickly. Just to see what it is. Okay, that's not helpful because that's a toxic planet. I don't think that'll be help. This one will be helpful either. I'm just having a look in the star system I was last at. Um, I'll guess what I started as well. What? No, that's that's another. This is another jungle planet. I didn't. Okay, I didn't go here. Um, House of Da Vinci Two. Ah, nice. Yeah, it's uh. It's interesting. <laughs> a little bit of a case of yeah, so they you know they changed this mechanism and they've changed rather than the obviously the eyeglass it was the past sphere thing. Right. And it was like, oh, okay, so that's changed. That's pretty cool. Mm. And then going into the past and changing things that alters things in the present and you're hopping to and from... Hopping to and from uh, past and present and... Yeah, I thought that was kind of cool, actually. I like the, um... That whole aspect of kind of, like... Same environment, but different different time. It's yeah. kind of cool. Oh, I need to go quickly go back to my ship. And it was like, uh, there was just this one bit, and I'm like, well, how do I do, you know, how do I do this, or, um, it's had me, it's had me thinking, um, quite a lot. And and it's been like, well, at one point, there's a bit, I'm sort of stuck, well, not stuck, but a bit stumped. And it's like, right, well, how am I going to supposed to do this? And then you've got to just figure stuff out, hopping and... You know, to and fro in from this, the present to the past, and... Yeah. It's just sort of figuring out where and what. You've got to sort of think a little bit outside the box. Because this, I'm only on the second chapter, it's just basically I'm... Obviously met Da Vinci, but I've got to do his task before he'll meet me properly. Right. And the one thing that actually did throw me off was there was actually voiced dialogue. I was like, what? Yeah. Because I wasn't expecting it. With the first game not having it. But yeah, so far it's it's enjoyable. Good. Yeah, I mean I um I enjoyed it. 
I mean, they changed some stuff up. I mean, it's very similar, but mm. they, um, you know, kind of changed up the flow of things a little bit. Yeah. But the one thing I was going to ask, but without obviously not trying not to get spoilers, is it linked with the first game? I know it says it's a sequel, but is there any direct reference to the first game? Uh, you know, it's been a while since I played it, so I can't even answer that question. Uh, okay. Because I know in the first game, one there was one of the letters, and you've got to do... Basically, Leonardo was working for this guy who basically wants... Try and sort of... Not stop him, but... Um, he's trying to escape from this guy, and it's like... Yeah, I mean, I think that there are some tie-ins from mm. the first game to the second game, but I forget specifically what. Not that you want me to tell you anyway, but... Um, yeah. But I'm sure that the dude that... Obviously, at the beginning, who spring who springs here. Um, who you then have to sort of work for by force. I'm sure he was referenced within the first game. Right. Just, I'm guessing it was something that was on a letter that's making me think that. I'd have to sort of go look back and see, but I'm sure there's sort of a little bit of a direct... tie-in to that dude. That's annoying. I can't even cheese. Oh, I got you. There we go. I've got to say, I couldn't even cheese that, because... Because of where the mm. enemy was. Okay, that thing can jump. Ow. You guys just fell into toxic water, didn't you? Yes, you did. Well, that was bloody clever, obvious. Um... Poisoned by something, but no, it's definitely it is different. I do like the obviously noticing the ch the change of how it's the style is, and it's like yeah, it's not a bad change. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Ooh. Something just gave me a scorched car. That's interesting. Don't know. I'm guessing an enemy gave me a Yeah. Enemy. Yeah, just kill something. Yeah. I haven't found a village yet, though, which is weird. I'm kind of hoping it wasn't the other direction, though. Because I went right, and I'm hoping that the village wasn't left. Yeah. But it's sort of fine. <laughs> I'm going to say, yeah, it's fine, but... Um, uh oh. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm on a alien planet. I mean, I know that's not specific to the type of planets we're supposed to be looking for, but 
Yeah. I, don't know. I mean, the Sabian stuff can show up anywhere. Clip. Can I even get up there? Come on. I actually remember to bring my soldiers with me this time. <laughs> yeah, because usually you seem to go alone. Yeah, because I often just kind of forget they exist. is another like research thing but I don't know if it's human or what that's weird it's not fun a village yet though Go. Have I got anything I can sell? I don't really need. No, because I need all that stuff. Okay. You've probably got nothing decent now. You've got nothing decent to uh -huh. trade. And then I just got ended up picking up one of them things that you know can either kill you, heal you, or give you walls. Right. Yeah, I got one of them, and it was yeah. silver. See how long it's going to take me to uh, complete that one. I mean, House of Da Vinci took me over six hours. <laughs> Which wasn't bad. Ah, uh, really? Well, you didn't like that then, did you? Some purple dudes. Uh, nothing good there, anyways. Oh, well, I found a um, abandoned pilotal village. All right. Some food. Well, I've got another t tomato seed. Because I found some tomatoes. Wait. Uh, food up for now. Try and use my food sparingly. Hmm. That's interesting. Snow. And a lot of snow. Uh, I'm not going that way. Um, 
manipulate module. I'll do. So you found an abandoned one. Yeah, it's like a high lot above ground high lotal place and um Oh god. Interesting. Like castle thing. Ooh, what the hell have I just found here? Oh god, this isn't gonna. They're not gonna be friendly. Nope, they're not friendly. Okay. Dude just decided to bug out on me. What's that? Oh no, decorative hourglass. Oh well, might as well take it. Anything in that one, nothing in that one, nothing in that one. Where am I? Oh, this is a bloody glitch place. But, for some reason, not a friendly glitch place. Yeah, that can happen. Okay, so not entirely abandoned, apparently. Hmm. Outside, I mean, there's been plenty of like enemies in here, but um, I found a uh, a merchant. These merchants generally never have anything of any value. No, they don't. And they're almost like as useful as the villagers in Minecraft. Yeah. <laughs> That is saying something. Can I actually... Might as well make some of that. With his goddamn glitch. Well, unfriendly glitch. Okay. We no, come. Thank you. God, you're trying to interact with some. And then you, you bloody crewmates get in the way. It's kind of annoying. Yeah. Well, they keep shutting doors in my face. Yeah. Which is annoying. A medieval glow, decorative. Oh, not blue. I'm guessing there's a. Block the eye. That was weird. You blocked the eyeballs, but you. No. No, 
that was really weird. This dude blocked eye the eyeballs, but then... But then didn't block... Yeah, I'll take it for selling value. Couldn't block gunfire, but blocked eye the eyeball attack for some reason. Hmm. Lucky. There we go. Maybe you lost one of your crew. Yeah. Well, I lost one that was like, oh, maybe he died, and then I went down. I I found him, and he just wasn't following me anymore for some reason. I might have accidentally like interacted with him, so I interacted with him, and he's like, yes, Captain. Yeah. And he started following me, and then. Now my other ones that was following me before is now missing. There we go. So you possibly accidentally dismissed. Maybe. But I could have sworn I only interacted with one of them, so I don't know why the other one... Whatever. Nothing in there. Nothing in there. Huh? No. Axe display decorative. Medicate. Huh? Dude, come on. So I kind of. Don't really want to go this way yet because maybe I do, but maybe I don't. Because it felt there's a massive black space there, but there's no way. To get to it, it feels like you could get to it, but maybe there's nothing in that space. Can you just break your way through? I could do. Could take a little bit. Because it's proper heavy stone brick. Oh. Uh. I'm not even sure if there's anything. Anything there. Yeah, man. I don't know if there's something there or not.
This is taking a while. Yeah, I hear you. I'd like to think of something there, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh, Jesus. He won't help you. No, probably not. Or did you find something? Oh, there's a bird I had seen before, but I had kind of killed it from a distance, and this time... Um, I did not, and, uh, got too close to it and, like, vomited on me. Lovely. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of don't think there's anything here. I think it's just a black space. But if this, well, if this actually went a little bit quicker, then I'd find out, but I just generally don't think there's anything there. Could be wrong, but... Yeah, I... Jim, we don't think is out there. Hmm. Oh well. Definitely stuff on this side though, more glitch. Oh, there we go. What the shit? There's a dude on a horse? There's a glitch knight on a horse. That's cool. It'd be a robotic horse, mind, but still, there's a dude in a horse. God, this goes on forever. Uh oh. Um, I found a present. All right. Holy crap, this glitch building is ridiculous. Guessing he's a king. Yeah, he was the glitch king.
kind of reminds me of that enemy we had to face in the uh, oh god what the hell do you call it that place I really hate talking about the same game no Minecraft what was that thing called oh, what? we proper cheesed him was it the Lich King? Oh, yeah, the, um, yeah, in the, um, Twilight Forest. Yeah. Who do you fight in? Well, that's good. You just knock, you, you knocked him off. He's not going to be dead, though. He's just going to be waiting for us when we get to the bomb. More goodies. Ugh. After, well, it's current. As I would say in Fallout 4, it's currency. Weapons that I don't need. Yep. Huh? You never know. Well, same here, you know. But it might, like I say, it might come up. There might be something useful. Possibly. Huh? Where did he? Did we? I think we. Yeah, we know. We came in this way. Okay. I really don't think that there will be uh, avian stuff here because this is just full glitch castle and I reckon this is just possibly not going to spawn. I reckon this will be the instead of a village. Yeah. Um. How the hell do I get out of here then? I want to get down to the ground floor, but I can't go that way to get down to the ground floor. Uh, place like a maze. to have a look with the control key. Yeah. A lot of inmates in here. Yeah? Yep. Not the friendly type. Nope. Yeah, they're all, all they're all free to roam around. I'm getting some decent uh, loot anyway while I'm here. Okay. Well, 
that was a horrible creature. It was like a flying bug thing. Which then decided to spit poison. Okay, so I've definitely not... No, definitely not been here. Anything else I can stack? I've been getting a bunch of uh, Duro Steel ore up here. Nice. Or over here. And uh, manipulator modules. Not bad. They're always good. We have a bunch more of those if you want to upgrade some of these other things. Mm. Alright. I mean, the one dude I still got with me is doing pretty well. Yeah, I kind of don't know where my other dude's going. Of a globe. Uh. Uh, well, if I've got silver ore, I'll quickly smelt it up into a silver bar. Dude, how are you not? getting killed off that. Oh, unless that's just decorative coal. Find everything else but what I want to find. Prison's freaking huge. Yeah, that's what I thought about the castle. That's annoying, the fact that, you know, you kill, you kill the, like, the horseback rider, you get rid of the horse, but then, dude, the dude then comes off the horse, and you have to fight said dude. Yep. Oh, I mean, it's kind of like Minecraft rules, I suppose. Yeah, I suppose. I'll watch my food. Mm. 
Let's no, I don't care about friggin' data disks. Data disks? Uh, like, more files. Uh, okay. Like, documents. Okay, made my way through the, um... Uh oh. Made my way through the prisoners. No, it's just them free. There's just free purple light dudes. Stood around a bunch of. No! Yes! Stupid dude. Can't remember where I started. Well, yeah, I'll be guessing there is probably no village, because I reckon that. That castle will have taken its place. Yeah. Oh, same for me. I mean, I don't think I'm going to find a village in that prison I was just in. left from where I start. And quickly. Okay, there is a village, a village of mushroom people. Or a little hut of mushroom people, anyways. That's cool. No. No. Dude, will you come? Yes. Yeah, get rid of that, will you? We'll go this way. Ooh. Mushroom. Not that I can actually grow out. Didn't I get mushroom land? Didn't I? Yeah, I think I learned how to do mushroom block last time. Yeah, I assume so. Um, Dude, you stood in the way. I am incorrect. I did find a village. However, not an avian one, but there was a, a village as well as the prison on this planet. Oh, ah, okay. So, oh, that makes sense. The prison is probably the target of the quest. For the stuff from this village. Yeah. So they usually always like have some sort of location to send you for some of the combat quests. Hmm. What happens if what do I get if I chop down the mushroom thing? Sapling and loads of mushrooms. Oh well. Stock up on the mushrooms. <clears throat> dude. Huh? Dude, uh, dude, get out of my way. Right, I'll just use my manipulator. Yeah, it's mushroom village. Huh? No. Huh? Yes. 
sure I did get mushroom block. Mushroom blocks. Fair enough. Might as well pick up enough mushrooms. I'm sure I can do something with the mushrooms. Alright, what have you got? Have you got anything to loot? Yeah, Jira still. What else you got? Fried knives and core fragments. Another weapon, but I need to get back and get my stuff. The friggin' are you fighting? Like a dandelion thing that's kicking out dandelions? Weird. Okay. Um. And that was random. So did a quest for a person here, and as a reward, I got a geometric door. Nice. From one of those loot packs. It's like, okay, thanks. So if you, on this planet thing, if you actually chop down the big mushroom, it's Minecraft all over again. Oh, you got little mushrooms? Yeah, you chop down the big mushroom trees and you get mushrooms. You get saplings, oh. but you actually get mushrooms. So that. Oh, that's, oh cool. okay. So that's how. Cool. So that's how we farm mushrooms then. Yeah. So, so I'm gonna cool. keep. I'll keep hold of the saplings. Yeah. So we can, like you say, farm some mushrooms. Don't know where we're gonna stick them. Like, we'll probably stick them outside of the base somewhere. Yeah. Nope. But I'm just sort of nabbing as many mushrooms as I can just in, just to try and get a little bit of food. Wait, but these guys haven't actually given me... What's that? Oh, Molotovs. Haven't given me any sort of quests to do, which doesn't really bother me. Mm. Let's actually get the banana tree. Guys, don't drag the enemy over here while I'm in the middle of something. Gee, where's? No. No. Uh, today's today's been a good day for uh, Madam Manipulator modules. Nice. I've got ten of them while I've been out and about. That's not bad. Yeah, that's, that's good. A lot more than I usually get in just a single run. Or a single planet. Ow, ow, ow. Uh, but... <sighs> nope, make that 11. Nice. 
You coming or what, dude? Huh. No. Met some frog people. Nice. Have I actually got any... Okay, that's kind of hilarious. So mm -hmm. these swamp, uh, these little swamp frogs. Um, yeah. I'm inside one of the uh, these little huts. The huts are really simple, but inside he's got like an actual like couch and like a TV. Nice. Okay, so just for confirmation, mushrooms are just cooking ingredients. You can't eat them raw. Yeah, I was wondering about that. I was going to make a comment about that. I, I wasn't sure if you could actually have those raw no. or not. No, you can't. Which is really annoying when I've got no food. <sighs> so much. I don't need sugar cane. You guys better keep me protected. Ooh, pineapple, pineapple, pineapple. A little bit of food. I'm not too far off my stuff. Because that would really suck. Did you die? No, I'm still alive. I've just not got a lot of health and I've got no med kit so... Hey, you need to stock up on that bag of peas. Well, I, I did die. So I'm having to go back and get my loot. Oh, well, yeah, that was my first question. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah, no, no. <laughs> Sorry. No, I didn't die. I just died. Yeah, no, I did. Okay. I mean, I've got, like I said, I've got a lot of... I do have a lot of like bandages and stuff like that. Uh, just keep my I'll come back for that in a minute. I oh, wasn't Actually, that. F yeah, I got four tomato seeds. Nice. Wasn't that actually that far from the village either when I died? Damn. Got my stuff back. Right. Uh, I'm gonna go ship. Whew. So yeah, I didn't find a mushroom village, uh, didn't find a... Avion village there, either. <clears throat> but, I'm gonna lie in the bed. And get my health back a minute while I look at my inventory. What did I actually get, then? Mushrooms... Silver, diamond, another scorched core. 
some Jura steel ore, some core fragments, yellow petals, some more leather. Four saplings. A uh, dark battle standard decorative, two axe display decorative, two globes, two hourglasses. Uh, I think that was it. Oh, did I get weapons? Oh, yeah, I got weapons. Got some stuff I need to drop off at my ship. My health is good now. Drop some bits off here. Drop them to upgrade modules. <coughs> them to tech cards, which takes me up to 17. 17 matter manipulator modules. And I have completely circumnavigated. Alright. Alright. Let's go to home base B a minute. Okay, so, are you back at... I'm base. back at base. Okay. Uh... Have I got seed wise? There's another banana. Uh, what's that? Have we got... Cocoa growing? Yeah, we got a full thing of cocoa. Ah, oh, okay, fair enough. I'll get rid of the seed. Really? G 
jump. All right, well, that's uh, 38 more Durasteel bars. Nice. That's cool. Uh... I've got 12 Jura Steel ore on me anyways that I haven't smelted yet. Oh, it's another six. So we get, which is good, that we have lots of uh, Jura Steel at the moment for more sprinklers. As well as other things, so I still need to make that rail station. Yeah. So I can do the elevators and stuff. See what grows there, shall we? No, oh, wrong room. What this room? Nothing there. That's a gold trip. Oh yeah, don't forget you got you got uh, them two gold drills and that pickaxe above the furnace in the mm -hmm. fourth chest. Have I got anything I... Uh, yeah, I picked up a, a gold drill on my way. Um, on my outing just now. Alright, this is scorched. Okay. Scorched it sells off all that stuff. Alright, let's see where else I can go here. Diamond in there. Yeah, I'm gonna end up going exploring as well. Uh, some silver. Some more Jura steel. There's some car fragments. Okay, next room. Seeds, leather, green stuff. LED. Where's the freaking. Oh, there is another jungle in this system. Cool. I've been to both, so I'll have to go to a different. On a uh, jungle moon. It's actually orbiting a uh, gas giant. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't think that was a thing. Yep, 
Cafe Journal. Why can't I find... Definitely not down here, is it? No. Got another banana seed. Nice. And sugarcane seed. I'm gonna put them mushrooms I've got there for now. Uh, okay, that hasn't been cooked. Then That's weird, why is that spring oh, I was gonna say that's weird, why is that sprinkler not getting that, but it did in the end. Um Have we got We've got four pineapples, haven't we, growing up? Have we got we've got pineapples growing here? Uh maybe. I think so. Hmm. Come on, get up there. Get up there. Come on. Do you know how annoying it is? 
how annoying it is and some people are at the moment in this country. How annoying what? 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 I said, do you know how annoying it is and how annoying people are in this country at the moment? Um, no. Very. People are panic buying fuel. Oh. Yes, because I want fuel. Uh, because our stupid media didn't come up with the truth, saying that one garage chain over here, which obviously is BP, were having issues of supplies. And because of this, that has caused people to go out and stockpile fuel. <clears throat> Sounds about right. But yet the, uh, the annoying thing is that, well, the people that need fuel can't get it. So, like, the emergency services and stuff are struggling to try and get fuel because people are being selfish and stockpiling fuel. But there's a law against how much fuel can actually be stored. So, people have to be careful because people have been filling up jerry cans as well and you're only allowed oh, to sure i mean only you... if they're caught right mm. you're only allowed to store so much um but uh, yeah but now most of the garages have become clever and stuck limits on right so, you're basically only allowed £30 worth of fuel at the pumps. So, that stops a lot of the panic buying. Yeah. In a way, but it limits how much people can actually... Yeah, it stops some of it. Get uh, their hands on, at least but... slows it down a little bit. Yeah. Well... I mean, I went to, get, went to get some fuel the other day after I'd been to the hospital and I was in a queue for about 10 minutes. Fun. Which wasn't bad considering that the day before people had been sitting there for nearly an hour because there's that many people wanting fuel. It's wow. it's bonkers. But if the me you know, if the media and the government had have done this properly, we wouldn't have panic buying on our hands. But it's it's like the whole global pandemic demic all over again. Except it's not toilet rolls this time. It's fuel. Right. Well, we have a, we have driver shortages here. So that's a, a bit of an issue. You know, there's HGV driver shortage, so supply problems are becoming a, an issue. Or, yeah. Well, driver shortage, I should say, really, in that. Which... Can't be helped. What do people expect? We're in a pandemic. People are going to be off yep. and all sorts. Yep. But it's just some people's mentality, I question. I really do.